everyone. So it's going to be my first vlog of a cruise in three years. I vlogged a Disney cruise three years ago, right before the pandemic hit. I was on a Disney ship, got off, everything shut down. I haven't felt like vlogging. I didn't do a vlog, but I'm going to, I'm back. I'm going to try it again. I have Allie with me this time. <laughs> We're at the Disney's Pop Century. We spent a few days here before we get on Allie's first Disney cruise. It's early. It's 7 a.m. My face is puffy because we've done nothing but run in the heat for two, three days at Disney. But we have our luggage tags on our bags. We do have transportation from Pop Century to the cruise ship. We have booked this through Disney. It's easy except for the fact that you do have to get up early because it's well it's 702 and they called yesterday and said that they'd pick up our bags at 7. i think they start the service at 7. so we have our bags ready we have the luggage tags on and now we're just we have to wait till 9 15 to go check in at the bus before that we'll probably go get some breakfast and take some pictures of the resort see you on the ship Please welcome aboard the Mullins and Atkins family. So we got on the ship and we did the wish ceremony and we came straight up here to Arendelle to have lunch. So a good tip is to to beat the madness of the buffet that's always on a ship the first day is to come up to the dining room. Arendelle is open for lunch on the first day. Did you like your meal? It was good. Yeah. It was delicious. So definitely come up here for lunch on your first day and just do the buffet another day. Come and sit down and rest and eat some very good food. Plus it's, it's frozen. It's Arendelle. <laughs> So we finished up our mustard drill, which was in the Marvel yeah. restaurant, and I came down here to open house because I just was only here allowed in on the first day as open house, but I wanted to check it all out, so I mean, Allie's 16, she's not going to be here, but I wanted to see it firsthand because I didn't get to see it the last time I was on here. <laughs> we have come down to check out the kids club just so I can tell people what it looks like and look at this little bitty party. how cute is it oh it does it lights up oh you can't really you can't really see that but it's the toy story ball love the head oh, there you go why are you obsessed with these hand washing machines <laughs> it's <looks> so good <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, this is where I want to hang out. I totally want to hang out here. <laughs> we found our spot. Of course, they're going to kick us out. Hey, Allie, you do know you're not actually driving the ship, right? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> originally brought to wear but I just can't get my hair to be anything so plan B maybe C all right so plan B was this one I think I'm gonna stick with plan B this was plan C it was cute it would sit in here but I think I'm gonna stick with my snowflakes We have come back to our room, watching the movie, 
to a lobster? I think it's a lobster. What do you think? I, I thought it was a... Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> And some chocolate. I love that they still give chocolate. And a note. I'll get ready to read that. I don't know what it says. I haven't read it yet. Something about... <gasps> no! To the Aquamouse. Alright, it's 12.38 and the movie was so good. I think it's better for Disney people, but it's, it's still a good movie. I like the plot, I like the storyline, and I definitely love all the ride nuggets throughout. I think the experience was even better because I experienced it with a theater full of Disney fans, so they understood when a part happened that you know meant something and if we if you saw a scene that was from the ride you saw um i don't want to tell you anything with the movie because you haven't seen the movie you want to watch it but as a disney lover if you are a fan of the haunted mansion ride you have to watch this movie have but anyhow we're back in the room i'm going to restart that because you told it first <laughs> or maybe i won't maybe i'll just leave us in there oh, <laughs> But we're getting ready to go to bed. Allie's going to sleep on the couch bed. I'm going to sleep in this bed. The beds on a Disney ship do not separate. They are wall one whole bed. It's probably the only cruise line. Well, it is the only cruise line I've ever been on that doesn't let doesn't separate the beds. So, if you are coming on a cruise with somebody that you don't want to sleep in the same bed with, then you need to do the couch. I mean, me and Allie sleep in the bed together. Um... But she's going to let me have it to myself because I rarely ever get a bed to myself. <laughs> you are sweet. Do you want to say goodnight? Good night. Good night. See everybody tomorrow.